drunken bear. Welcome to the drunken bear. Oh, that was loud for all of us, wasn't it? Um, today we're talking about London versus Melbourne. So the differences between London and Melbourne. Is that it? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. We really wanted to talk about this topic, especially since we went to um, the UK and we have Hello. British <laughs> guest. Hi, we live life in a box, and yes, we are from London, UK. So we can tell you all about that. Yeah, so they are YouTubers as well. You should check out their channel as well um, after watching this. And yeah, so we're gonna talk about um, all the differences and similarities um, between Melbourne and London. So first thing we will talk about is food. Food. Yeah. Yeah. food. Are we love? Oh my god, food is always number one. So, food. Let's start in supermarket. Let's start in supermarket. Yes. So, in we found out in Melbourne you have Coles and Woolies, but in London and in the UK you have loads of different supermarkets. Oh my god, loads. Morrison's, you've got Morrison's. Yeah. No, it's more out of town. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's oh, cheap. It's the cheap. Oh. It's the cheap one. And you've got Asda. Uh, we've got Iceland, Aldi, Tesco's. Tesco, Sainsbury's, yeah, so Waitrose. Waitrose, if you're feeling a bit posh or have some money, <laughs> yeah. we go to Waitrose. We often don't. We often don't go there, <laughs> but yeah, if you have some money, you can go to Waitrose. Um, in London, everything is kind of expensive, but not like um, in supermarkets. Like supermarket, everything is like way cheaper than. Mm. Well, yeah, 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 absolutely. Although the lettuce seems nicer in Australia, the lettuce in England is like 60p. <laughs> yeah. Whereas it's, I think, $3? Yes. Oh, that's $2.50 or yeah. something yeah, like that. Yeah. So it's cheaper, but maybe not as good. And like what we enjoy is getting something called a meal deal, which is a sandwich, crisps, and a drink for three pounds. Yeah, yeah. that's... We, we survived on the meal oh deals. Oh my god, they saved our budget. Deal. Yeah, yeah. A meal deal. Yeah. Thanks to meal deals. It's just <laughs> like... And all the sandwiches they've got, it all looks so scrumptious. Like, really looks so nice. And it's got like... Yeah, with a meal deal, you yeah. can have chips, drinks as well. I thought it was just one supermarket, but it seems like all of, all of the shops do the meal deal. Yeah. 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 And it's in always three pounds. And also like... Uh, like frozen pizzas, I also think they are amazing. <laughs> yeah, that saves us when we live in London. <laughs> yeah. Pizzas and meal deals. Pizzas and meal deals. <laughs> and the frozen pizza is so cheap, but it's such good quality. Yes. Maybe we should talk about the bargains or like the reduced oh, the reduced section, section. <laughs> the reduced section oh. in the supermarkets because mm. we love reduced stuff. It's amazing. Uh, in Australia, you can always find reduced stuff all over the supermarket. It's really it's good. It's really good. This is, it's, but like. In England, we'd have them in a separate area, mm. whereas here they have just everywhere. So you can yeah. go bargain hunting. You can go bargain hunting. It's really fun, and <laughs> like uh, no one in Australia seems to grab the deals really That's quickly. True. Yeah. No, no, people just walk straight past it. Yeah, yeah. Really? we grab it. Not these but guys. No one else. <laughs> And um, in England or London, like you have the section, and then you have like everyone rushes to the <laughs> section and gets it, and it's a fight. Yeah, it's yeah. like With survival the of the fittest. Yeah, it goes primal. <laughs> houses! 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 London, it's very hard to get a rental house, really difficult. You have to, it's like a competition, and you always have to go to interviews. Say how much you earn, meet the housemates, all this. Really difficult. And if you see one advertised, you have to do it straight away. Yeah. Otherwise, there's no chance you won't yeah. get it. it. You don't really have time to look around and go, do I like that? It's look around and go, yes, yes, this one, get me in. <laughs> yeah. it. Here's the money, throw money at yeah. <laughs> Usually just one yeah. room. If you're gonna live as, as a, couple, a couple, yeah. Maybe and then exactly. you've got a little bathroom on the side. Tiny, you can barely fit in it. It's very funny. And that's huge. <laughs> yeah, it's huge, spacious. Yeah. And that would cost, I mean, what that would cost, cost that one? £800 a month. Yeah. £800. Nine, 900 pounds. Nine hundred including bills. So £900 everything. Pounds. That would be like, like... How many dollars? It's like 
about yeah, yeah about like almost double isn't it yeah it's almost like yeah maybe 1400 1400 yeah, yeah, yeah. that sounds very good for a studio yeah. tiny room yeah. where is it is this up like so we were quite again quite lucky so we were in yeah. a place called Finchley Central Finchley yeah. Central yeah. which is actually it was a really nice area yeah zone four so zone quite four. far out of the city about 40 <laughs> 45 minutes out? Yeah. Yeah, 45 wow. minutes out of Melbourne, you'd get like pretty good Luxurious house. house. Like a three bedroom yeah. house for that. Mm. Oh, wow. We've been Airbnb and we think everyone's rich. Yeah, we mm. do. Everyone has such luxurious houses. And... Have you got a kitchen with a door between your bedroom? Ah, <laughs> you have separate rooms for me. Oh, wow. When That's you come, crazy. when guests come in, they don't sit on your bed. Ah. <laughs> yeah. How much should you pay for Melbourne rent nearer to the city? Is yeah, it more expensive? City for studio. Yeah. How much does it pay? Um, so I think three fifty a week. Oh, well, Matt. Oh. <laughs> it's about fifteen, sixteen hundred. Is it? Oh wow. Yeah, fifteen hundred. Well, that sounds cool. <laughs> and that's in the city. In the city studio. That uh, probably you'd probably spend like two thousand. Oh yeah. Month. Oh. The wages are so much better in Australia comparatively. Like minimum wage, is it twenty dollars an hour minimum wage? Eighteen yeah. something maybe. Oh, yeah, eighteen. I think it's seven pounds twenty. Mm. So that's like thirteen dollars. Thirteen or fourteen. Yeah, maybe something mm. like that. So it's not that good. No, and we don't really have much of a tipping culture like America that would. No, that we're just subsidised. We do tip a bit, but not. Yeah. It's not expected. Work culture seems very different, but here in Australia, it's like um, I think it all depends on jobs. But they finish like they start from nine and they finish about five. Five. Yeah, so yeah. it varies, but that's pretty much the main office. Usually in London, you start really early. So I had a job, an office job, and I used to start at eight o'clock. And I left at five, but everyone in the office would look at me and be like, "Why are you leaving at five? Oh my God. I said, like, well, I've been in since eight. And they would stay until seven, eight o'clock. Oh and then same thing next day. So really, it's a very, like, harsh work. Australia seems to be a lot more relaxed. Very, they're a lot slower. Um, I don't think I've just had luck throughout my whole working life. But yeah, no matter what kind of job I've done, um, different areas, everyone's just, it's a slower pace. There's heaps of coffee breaks. There's, yeah, it's just, you know. <laughs> Wow. Coffee break. Coffee, coffee break. What's big. that? Coffee. Like in London. <laughs> no, you don't really even have breaks. You're gonna work yeah. dinner. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the other thing also, which we want to know if it's different, is sick leave, annual leave, all that kind of thing. So Australian annual leave is pretty much the same. It's like four weeks off holidays, ten days sick leave. Do you guys have a lot of leave? Yeah, when I worked in my office job, I think we got about a month of annual leave mm. for the whole year, so like 28 days or something like that. Mm. I think that also wasn't including Christmas and bank mm. holidays, so that was quite yeah, good. It was pretty, pretty good. good. Seems quite, was quite I was about to say, yeah. And the sick leave, yeah, you would get paid sick leave. I think you're allowed like five days or something of paid sick leave, mm. and then you can take unpaid after yeah. that. I mean, the hard, the hard thing's good. just ringing up to do the sick leave. Yeah, just that's like true. even if you've stubbed your toe, you've got to be like, hello! <laughs> yeah, I'm bad, my foot. <laughs> Can you get away with text ever? Or it's oh, nah, you, you've sense. got to do the thing. Uh, in my experience, no one saves money really, or not many people. Like, everyone's like, oh, do you want to go out tonight? Oh, uh, nah, I'll get paid tomorrow. So, like, you'd have a whole week's wage and you spend your week's wage. Yeah. Kind of. yeah. And then it goes in, and yeah, it was already. Yeah, I think most people are paid. Zero. Well, they live into the next paycheck. I yeah, they say yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you can kind of depend on it. Yeah, yeah. it will come in every month. Yeah. Ours doesn't. Ours doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> we get on reduced aisle. <laughs> yeah, if you're self-employed, it's a bit different. So we're both both self-employed. So we basically make money and then spend it straight away. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we yeah, I can't really make money savings. No. So our jobs are quite varied really, yeah. So it's not a regular income. Guess what they have, like what their job is. Like it's very mysterious, like they're building up. <laughs> never telling you what <laughs> jobs they've got. They have so many You will jobs. find out from their channel. That's oh. Oh. oh, good segue. I like oh. it. Yeah. yeah. 
<laughs> and if you want to see behind the scenes for this channel, mm. yeah, we'll figure out. Yeah, what's the mystery oh, wow. self-employment? What is <laughs> <a> self-employment? <laughs> Transform. You guys win. Let's <laughs> just win. Hands down. Yes. Yeah. Mikey What's versus that? oyster. oyster. Oh. I mean, actually, Mikey itself is okay. It's a, it's pricey, but the actual what you get um, is pretty bad. Like the the waiting times for Australian trains, the speeds. Once you try to go out to somewhere, like waiting for a train, you have to check your app when the train is coming. Mm. Otherwise, you have to wait 20 minutes just to sitting there. So, and um, if you are lucky, you can get a train like in 10 minutes or 20 minutes. But like late at night or weekends, it, it becomes like 30 minutes or 40 minutes. And we used to like complain on the tube when we had to wait five minutes, and we never will ever again after coming to <laughs> Five minutes is great. That's, that's pretty much the maximum you'll wait for a train in, yeah. in, in London. And, and I'll be constantly yeah. apologizing, saying, I'm oh, sorry, it's in 10 minutes. Or... Yeah, and the buses here, oh my god, they're also another thing. Like, they even don't turn up sometimes. Like, mm. so many times they turn up very late or very early. So if you get there on time, you might <laughs> think maybe it's gone or it's coming. Like, yeah, you never can't tell know it. It's come oh. early or it's come late. Yeah, it's come awful. Awful. So it's get there really early. Yeah. What about yeah. buses over there? Buses? You never plan buses in London, you just You go. just get on the bus and there's such a good app called City Mapper which you can download and then it will just tell you of all the buses in the area, what time they're coming, like where you get off it tells you as well. It's really good, you can follow your journey and they come like all the time, probably every five minutes, mm -hmm. some is every ten. Yeah. It depends on the bus but you can always just hop on a bus. Nick off. Nick off. really funny. <laughs> Duna is such a funny word. Duna. Well, Duna. We've never heard of that before we came to Australia. Uh, how are you going? It's quite funny. How are you going? It's funny. You're going by foot. You call trousers pants, right? Not trousers. Yeah, no one says trousers. You would say pants. That's very oh, fancy. One of the best things was when we were in a car and we were going to a, a house sit mm -hmm. and our host a house sitting host said, I always wear thongs. Oh! <laughs> and, and to an English person, that was quite shocking. So it's like, why are we talking about underwear? Thongs oh. means underwear. Oh, I thought yeah. that was just an American thing. I thought so. No. Very oh. skimpy underwear. Yeah, so it's a very, quite a shocking thing to tell me. I was so when I was just thought, talking. Oh, my thongs come off. Really? Oh, God. Yeah. So we'd call them flip flops. That's true. Oh, we'd like to say hello to someone. We'd just say, all right. Yeah. Oh, that's really, right. Yeah. Right. All right. And the answer right. is the answer is all right. The answer is all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. I also also I'm uh, from the north, so I'd also say now then to say hello. Now then. Now then. Now then. Now then. And the answer to that is now then. <laughs> really? That's a really. You can't say anything else. You can. It just means hello. But it'd be like me saying. You could say now then. You could say hello. But I'd be like mm, posh. <laughs> also, how do? How do? <laughs> and all right can also turn into y'all right. Y'all right, yeah. yeah. This isn't very no. London. No. <laughs> no, I'm not even going to do London. No. In, 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 in it, yeah, in it. Everything, in it. yeah. Hello. Weather. Clear your SD card. London is <laughs> We're about to talk oh, So is Melbourne, so who, who loses? We all lose. Oh I think we all lose. It's the same. Oh, yeah. Yeah. In England, we think Melbourne's weather's really good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, that's what it's, it seems like a beach. Because mm. when we came, we didn't even bring coats. <laughs> and we came in October. It's no, still like the winter. No. We were freezing and we couldn't believe it. Because we just brought shorts and dresses. And surfboards. And surfboards. We expected <laughs> everyone to be walking around with a surfboard. Mm. Uh -huh. I don't know about y'all. Whereas I think it, when people come to London, they tend to go, the weather was quite good, because I think everyone thinks the weather's terrible. Yeah, yeah. I think it's been built up so, yeah. so much to be really bad. We found it, it was pretty decent, it was yeah. pretty good. Yeah, I think the London weather was not as bad as people sound like, because um, I thought it's going to rain every day. It rained during, <laughs> like, we stay for 10 days, but not every day. No. And yeah. also, I really don't like four seasons in one day, so it's like 
in the morning it's freezing <laughs> and then it gets better 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 and then it and just goes again. down yeah mm -hmm. it's just yeah. like always oh, like that you have to bring your jacket with you when you go to work yeah that's yeah. what you need whereas we like when it's raining outside in melbourne sometimes we put sun cream on before we go yeah. out because we know in a minute it'll be it'll summer. change mm -hmm. to be scorching and then we'll burn yeah mm. yeah but in the UK, usually in the day it'll be the same, same weather all day. So if it's raining, guarantee it'll be raining later. Coffee versus tea. So that's a pretty big one because coffee is massive here in Melbourne and I imagine it's pretty big tea over there. So. Tea is big in the UK and London. Everyone, if you go around someone's house, they will offer you a cup of tea straight away. Straight away, they might offer you a coffee, but tea is more likely, yeah. I think. And if they don't, I'm, I'm always a bit suspicious. Yeah. Also, it's kind of normal for once you've finished it, they ask if you want another tea. And I, I do, mm. always. I, we will chain drink tea. Do they always have a black tea? Other tea Mainly, Mainly just breakfast tea bag as well. Tea, yeah, tea bag or loose leaf like black tea, mm. yeah. And there are a lot of tea shops as well in Britain that sell tea and cake and like, what was it called? Cream tea as well. Cream tea. Cream tea. Oh, cream in the tea. Yeah, this is the same as Devonshire this tea. This is a big topic. This is a big topic now. Okay. <laughs> cream tea is scones, jam, and cream, and oh. you serve it with a cup of tea. Oh, yum. Like oh, Devonshire tea. So that's what cream tea is—the whole set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It sounds oh. confusing. It sounds like you have cream in a tea. Yeah. 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 Oh, like where is it? Australia is coffee is more bigger deal. Like mm. people Especially order here tea. In yeah, yeah, people still order tea, but like maybe only 20-30% of people, they buy tea in a cafe and they usually have coffee. Oh, the thing you found, like from Melbourne? Like, yeah, so like we found that toilets are free to use in Melbourne, all over Melbourne, and as are water fountains as well, which is fantastic because in London you do not have water fountains and toilets cost at least one pound to use per time. Definitely. That's a lot. They seem hard to find too, even. Hard to you gotta find. know, you gotta really have a hard. Oh. Yeah. And, you, and, and you've always got there because you can also go into pubs. I yeah. don't want you to do that, so you've got to kind of pretend on your phone. Or meet my friend. Like go, oh, where's everyone? I'll just go to the toilet. I'll just meet my friend oh, in yeah. the toilet. <laughs> and, and everyone behind the bar is like, we know what you're doing. And for but, water, yeah. water, you've got to buy a bottle of water. Yeah, no water fountains anywhere. And also, no barbecues. No barbecues. Which seems normal, but yeah. 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 We now love them. We've been so impressed with the barbecues all over Australia and the parks at the beachside. It's we really love cool. them. Yeah. yeah, free barbecue is actually pretty it's cool. Really it's really cool. a good idea. Have you gone to the um, public toilets that have um, music on? Oh, ah, those are the ones, yeah. No, the like, soft cleaning ones. No! Uh, are, they, are they paid for ones? No, they're free no, as they're well. Free. Where oh, are, are they? they? Are they in no, Australia? Yeah, yeah. Really? No. Like, yeah, right. you get into the toilet. And, and then you got a 10 minute... Yeah, it's button. got a 10 minute minutes and then music... Oh, yes, yeah. we have. Oh, like, oh, a little button oh, thing and it closes yeah, and it talks to you. Park, right? Yeah. Oh, it talks to you. Yeah, yeah, it's like, hello, this is your toilet experience. It's so good. 10 minutes. And after 10 minutes, it rings as well. Like, it's so embarrassing. I feel like um, the door is gonna open. Oh, it does. It does automatically open, I think, after a It does? Time. What? It's scary. Oh, but, like, you've it. got a time limit. No, uh, that's scary. On you. And That'd put you off. That would put you off. You'd be like, I can't go now. <laughs> 10 it's, minutes. It's like a time bomb. Oh, yeah. yeah. Really does the music get worse and worse? <laughs> that horror music. Just turns yeah. into a screech at the end. Okay, so if anyone's still watching this video, <laughs> I really true. doubt. Uh, well, welcome to the fifth hour. Yeah. <laughs> this, is, this has been uh, the Drunken Bear with Live Life in a Box, London versus Melbourne. Thank you for watching this video and um, please check out their channel yeah, and find out what their job <laughs> Find out what living life in a box means. Yeah, so, what mm, it means. Yeah. yeah, and then subscribe to their channel and subscribe to our channel as well. And please like this video and leave any comments if you have any questions. And we will see you next time. Okay, see you. Bye. 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 Oh, yes. <laughs>